I'm mixing up uh, our epoxy for today. Uh, a lot of times I've already poured the epoxy in the pail. I like to mix in a third container and I'm going to pour half of the catalyst in here and then stir it and then I'll pour it in the pail and then pour the other half. This just helps get the rest of the epoxy out of this can. And then when I put it in I'm going to stir 200 times and I'm going to count as I do so I'll be kind of quiet and then uh, I'll let this sit while I get my brushes and rollers ready, I get my chips ready, I'll get everything set and that'll give us a time to, to uh, cure a little bit and that's going to make it harden on the floor about two or three hours faster, maybe an hour and a half faster because it's going to, going to have some time for the chemical action to start. I'm going to start counting here, make sure I get this done right. Okay, it's 200 strokes. I'm going to let it sit here. I'll stir it just a couple times before we do the next coat. And I'm going to uh, mix up my color chips now. Now the client's decided that she'd like to have these color chips uh, using the, uh, the gray and the cream color and the black. So the black are a little larger chips in the bag than the other two so I'm going to put those in first and start breaking them and so I'm just going to, she wanted equal parts of each so I'm going to just do one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's make sure I have enough here. And I'm going to break these up with my hand because she wants a little smaller chip. Now, I have to be a little careful that I break everything up, otherwise I'll end up with a couple big chips, so that's why I'm doing them first. Now the client, she wanted the black chips to be just a little bit bigger than the other ones. She thought that it would look less like dirt and more like chips then. So I got to kind of make a judgment as to when I have the right size. And there is a chance that I'll have a couple of them here that are too big, but that'll be some of the variety we have. Okay. So gray, one, two, three, four, five, six, and the cream colored, one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll probably squeeze them a little bit in my hand just before I throw them on if I see a big chip or two. So, there we go. Got our mix all set to go for us. Now, these chips I have, I can sweep those up 
Uh, but as I'm throwing them, if I get some by my feet, if I just roll over them with the epoxy, they'll just disappear.